So here's my Walesco D14 running on gas. It's got the smallest Bix burner in it. Turn right down and uh, as you can see, ample pressure there. Fitted a regulator to this on the exhaust side, which works fairly well. Simple globe, globe valve in the exhaust there. And what it's running is uh, pretty much a full Velasco workshop. This has been a work in progress for quite some time. Never seem to get around to finishing it, but um, I've done it now. You can see the various bits of tooling there. Um, spent a bit of time getting them all in the same shade of green. And everything seems to be working pretty much as it should. And hopefully to fairly scale speed as well. The line shaft is, as you can see, it's homemade. But it turned out alright. The uprights are actually pieces uh, of one of those pressed steel shelving brackets that you can get for a couple of pounds. I've soldered, you can probably see on this end better, just soldered a Meccano end stop on there to act as a bearing and all of the pulleys are Meccano as well, different sizes. So that's, uh, that's ticking over quite nicely. I like the D14. It's a nice powerful engine. You can see there's uh, even on a well, I don't know if you can see the flame in there, but it's, it's turned down pretty much to minimum. And we've got, uh, what does that say, 10 PSI. Safety's just bubbling a little bit. It'll run a lot faster, even with that load, which is not inconsiderable for a small engine. And it's keeping pretty much the same steam pressure. So. Quick aerial view. Get the steam off the lens. And, um, yeah, that's about it. Oh, I forgot to mention the base for the workshop. That's just one of those cheap chopping board things, uh, bamboo. And all I've done with that is just marked out some some uh, dummy floorboards just with a fine liner and uh, got the yacht varnish. Hmm, quite pleased with that. So oh, there you have it. That's my uh, that's my will it will 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 let's go workshop and the good old D14 pairing. So thanks for watching.